victory in 1914 here live at the 2010 Clark Atlanta homecoming. How do you feel about such an emotional victory? Well, we know a win's a win, and that's the way we look at it as coaches, but I mean, it was great for our fans, great for our alumni. Uh, Dr. Jones and Dr. Brown have done a great job of supporting this program and what we want and what we need. Uh, you know, it just showed that our cans can't finish. Uh, but, you know, we've got a lot of work to do. You know, we've got five games left, uh, four here at home. I'm just glad that we got that home game uh, jettles out of us, and now we can really come back and focus and do what we need to do. So hush not, child, and don't cry. Your folks might understand you by and by. Move on up and keep on wishing. Remember your dream. Coming live, Miss Joy Kirk, the media director here at Clark Atlanta, the Panthers. We want to know, Miss Kirk. Why do you feel like this particular department is inspirational to the school and has a lot to do with the growth with Clark Atlanta, in particular with the HBCU? Well, it's very important for sports information to get involved by all means. We are the public relations department of the school. We make sure we exude professionalism and media and making sure we also exude school spirit. We want to give you BTV. This is a big extravaganza at the Clark Atlanta 2010 homecoming. Do you have anything you would like to say? Just a little faith. Do it live, and we do it for the hood. Listen, listen, we visited Q's. We road trip all the way up here from Morgan State University, Baltimore, Maryland. So I guess the festivities, the festivities go, we're going to be at the, um, the step show. And then there's a, I know it's going to be parties. It's Atlanta, it's Clark Atlanta, come on, you know it's popping, you know it's popping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go with the Q dogs from Maryland, folks, coming way from Maryland. The Bloody Podcast, the, Bloody Podcast. Podcast. the Morgan State University. Big up the MBTV, baby. Big up the MBTV. We're here live with the class of 2014 at Well, we're growing, we're a work in progress. Of course, our program is only 10 years old. And we're very excited and we're happy to be a part of the homecoming festivities today. And I have, we've got a show for you. enjoyment, we give you the dazzling dancing tigerettes. Watch their move to Congo by Gloria Estevan. Oh, 
journalism in a large arena in order to get the viewpoint of African-American women into mainstream media. Into mainstream media, folks. So we have Miss Senior Clark Atlanta. Do you have any ambitions after graduating from Clark? Yes. Um, in May, I would like to work for St. Jude Children's Research Hospital as a public relations consultant. Beautiful, folks. Here it is, folks. This is the future of America. Nothing but success. Miss Senior Clark Atlanta and Miss Clark Atlanta coming live with NBTV. Yes, with the beautiful Panther Band. Turn it around. Vision and pride.
We got the MVP of the game, Mr. Marquise Brown. We definitely like your work today, man. How do you feel about catching that ball right at the end zone with 30 seconds left on the clock as you guys close the game up? Well, actually, it was Winston. Winston caught the ball in the end zone. I caught the ball in the goal line. But I mean, I was just, I was just happy, happy, happy to be in the position to win the game, especially after I fumbled earlier. I felt like I put the team in a very bad situation. So it was good to, to come back and be in the position to win the game at the end. How do you guys feel about next week, your uh, game next week, and how do you feel about being 3-2 and two now in the conference? Do you feel like you guys can steamroll and, and, and pick up steam in the conference and do very well? Well, right, right now we're just taking it one day at a time. And um, Coach mentioned at the end of the game today that we're going to have a new mindset when we practice and, and, and be more focused and prepare better. So we won't have, we won't come out like how we came out today. We'll come out with uh, with some urgency, which is what we kind of like today. We like what you guys doing over here at Panthers Field. We have Mr. Marquise Brown, one of the standout players here today. And there it is, folks, as the Panthers win 1914 live 2010 homecoming. So hush not, child, and don't cry. Your folks might understand you by and by. Move on up and keep on wishing. Remember your dream is your only scheme. So keep on pushing.